people think that the best way to escape war is to dwell upon its horrors and to imprint them vividly upon the minds of the younger generation. They flaunt the grisly photographs before their eyes. They fill their ears with tales of calm. The Great War enters its darkest hour. Both the Allies and the Central Powers are exhausted, devastated by the scale of the ongoing massacre. In one battle alone, the banks of the River Somme devour more than a million corpses, riddled with bullets, poisoned by gas, dismembered by shrapnel, and torn down in ruthless hand-to-hand -hand combat. Clouds of toxic gas and flames smother the Earth's dead surface. Artillery shells, in their millions, raise mountains of dirt and destruction so high that the sun and the moon disappear. The thunderous echoes of war drift deep underground. Soon, few will have the courage to venture near. But there is another reason why some people have named this part of France No Man's Land. Get up, soldier. It's time. Damn. I dreamt someone was telling me not to wake up today. Don't tell me you're superstitious, Yankee boy. I was dreaming about my chain. And she wasn't doing too much talking. <laughs> We've been cooped up in here for too long. Looks like someone up there is crying over our fate. In England, we call it rain. It's going to be over tonight. We'll break through Jerry's line with one strike. We know they're desperate. They're weak. They won't know what's hit them. So, keep your heads down and your guns up. Tank squads have got our flanks covered, and we're the blade that's going to rip those German trenches apart and carve the enemy up like the vermin they are. Like the rats they love to eat. Remember this hour. Tonight, the forces of evil will be crushed once and for all. This is the call of duty. What a load of horseshit. No surrender, no retreat, only victory. For king and country, boys, let's destroy those bastards.
Good God! I thought you were dead like everyone else. Oh, maybe you were right. I think I've been buried alive. An American corpse? Eh? How long have I been out? Do I look like a bloody cuckoo clock? Hey, are you okay? Of course I'm okay. But you look terrible. Here, this should fix you up. Hi! <laughs> it's been a bit, uh, I'm not... I mean, with all the screams and banging outside. Hey, but look. I've managed to unjam this bloody rifle. Maybe we can get out of this alive. Okay, but be careful with that thing. <laughs> so, where are the rest of our men? Are you insane? We are the rest. We're the last, the lost, the forgotten. The entire 3rd Battalion is dead. Crouch took no prisoners. Everyone outside got a bullet in the brain or swallowed a lung full of gas. Thank God I was able to jam this door tight enough to keep the poor bastard out. Knocking and kicking, but you're not coming in. Nobody's home. Wait a minute. Are you trying to tell me that the Germans couldn't break their way in here? <laughs> what Germans? If the Krauts had any idea someone was in here, they'd just put a cannon to our backsides and blast us back to Blighty. No, those buggers were back in our own trenches when all this happened. So... If it wasn't the Germans, who was trying to get in here? The oh, whole goddamn 4th Battalion running away from the gas! Oh, I had no chance. That's my division. Those were my friends, soldier. It's a British army, I think you'll find. And you didn't let them in. Just saved yourself. If I'd opened the door, those sorry bastards wouldn't be the only ones lying dead right now. How the hell are you going to live with yourself? For the rest of your life, you wake up with their screams in your ears. Do you think I give a damn about that? Keep back. I will use this. It's war, and they died. If I'd have opened the door, the Germans and the gas would have followed them straight through. Understand? We wouldn't be having this conversation. No, I'm going to get through this, don't you worry. Look, I've got some papers from a dead German officer. I know their patrol routes, their passwords, their secret weapons locations. <laughs> I even know the name of his bloody maid, Helga. <laughs> look, look how fat she is. I'm going to wait until dark and get myself out of here unnoticed. <laughs> Perhaps I'll take you with me, if I let you live. Okay, here's the deal. You can keep Helga, but I'll take those papers. I don't take orders from anyone. No, you're a great leader of men. You shoot that thing and the whole Bavarian army will be here in seconds. Okay, okay, you're right. We should do this thing quietly. It's unbelievable. First hand-to-hand -hand fight of the war is with a madman who's on my side. Oh, this whole place smells like a slaughterhouse. I'm not waiting for Nat to get the hell out of here. me off! Lost, lost, lost! from 
from this gas. And my only way... Guess there's no choice. You should count yourself lucky, though, boy. No one else is leaving this room. Take a side street. I am defending the enemy's attacker. You're on an express train to hell. I could just stay alive. Get through that damn gas over no man's land back to the British lines. Division, buddy. I got a message from the dead. This is not my fault. I'm only following orders. I bet you are. So what's going on here? There were things in there, terrible things. I don't even know what to call them. But we had to stop them getting to us somehow. We put up a barricade, and then last night, some traitor tried to blow it up. But I shut him down. You start making sense now. I'm telling you, they came out of nowhere, from out of the ground. They took people. We never saw them again. So we're blocking sectors off, keeping them back. They may even be in this hospital. That's why I was ordered to spray everything. Nobody goes in or out. Sweet Jesus, what the hell are you talking about? You swallowed too much of your own gas, pal. All right, here's what's going to happen. You give me your mask and I'll go in there myself. I have my orders. You have your orders now. That's a good boy. Another step. But I'll shoot! All I need is the mask. I gotta get through that barrier. It's the only way out of this hellhole. 